All right, you guys, so I was blown off by a man. Mm, nothing new there. Exciting stuff. What? I work out on vacation now. Who knew? Okay, free boob lift. Go to the gym, put your arms up here for three minutes, do this, three rounds. We did it in boxing. You're welcome. Okay, we got glow nuts at Alfred, which is such an LA thing to do. They're raw, vegan, gluten-free, and keto, right up my alley. I've had to buy it. I, 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 uh, these are so good. Also, I'm so LA right now with my eye patches, my bra, my Alfred coffee, and my keto donut. Okay, when we lived in LA, we would always go to Alfred and then we would go hike, so cheers. Cheers. Mm. All right, when I hike, I always do the ball of bands, headphones, and then Graham walks ahead of me and I stay back here and I chill and I jam. All right, there we were. We're coming up. Okay, we used to do it in 30 minutes when we lived here, and we just did it in 16. I think that's that boxing cardio. Okay. You do a chin up. That's all. You got more in the tank. That's it. Just hanging out. We went to dinner and then came back. Chilling right now. Maybe watch a movie. Yeah. Okay, I was gonna vlog my Canadian tuxedo that I wore tonight, but we'll have to pop up some photos of it because I really loved it. And I think for fall, it's gonna be a jean explosion, which I love. In, in last week's episode, we actually talk about like not drinking as much. Um, well, I said I'm not, I said I don't ever see the point of not ha like having two glasses of wine at dinner. And it's been fun because I had mocktails tonight. Smile. <laughs> I got a hat to protect from the sun. I bought it myself. I'm so excited. I've never actually done an unboxing because I've never actually bought the bag myself. So this one feels really good. Okay? Okay. Here we go. Okay, she can have a gold strap like this. We love her for that. Or, and it can get, it can get lower. Um, it can get shorter, but, or it could be like this. Uh-huh. She's beautiful. I call her the boxer. Okay, now she is cheaper and she is so much cuter. Back to New York we come. Bye LA. Nothing like a bloody nose to start your morning. The thing with working out is I love working out, but I don't really wanna do it right now. And that's okay, I don't need to do it, but I know I'll feel better after I do it. So that's why I'm gonna do it if that makes any sense. But also I'm gonna run to my favorite coffee shop in Rhode Island too. And then my mom's gonna meet me and we're gonna walk. So it's gonna be a cute little morning, you know? I'm excited. Okay, so I only made it one mile, <laughs> but my knees were killing me. So I, you know what, I listened to my body and I was like, you know what? I'm not gonna run anymore because I don't wanna get injured. So now we're just walking really fast. We're gonna go get a large, large coffee because in Rhode Island things are cheaper than New York. In New York, we're looking at like $10 for a large coffee. In Rhode Island, we're looking at like, I don't know, 260 something. I'm also listening to an audiobook right now about putting yourself first and having good vibes and surrounding yourself with good vibes in your life to have a good life. Sorry, I'm not really making sense because I'm dying and the sun is bright. I found my mom and she bought me sunglasses. Yay! Now, Hi everyone. <laughs> now we're gonna walk home. Say hi, Elsie. Hi, sweets. Hi, sis. Hi, hi sweets. Hi, sweets. Well, you know, you're at the fruit bill from, you know, what, what, 
All right, you guys, so I was blown off by a man. Mm, nothing new there. I'll talk more about it on the podcast. But since I was, I'm gonna go get some tattoos. I've been wanting three new tattoos for about a week now, and I'm impulsive, so when I want something, I usually get it immediately because I don't like to think about things. So I'm gonna get um, a tattoo on my wrist, a tattoo on my finger, and then a tattoo on the back of my ankle, and I will show you guys what they are. But I'm so excited, so let's go get a tattoo. And that I Okay, so I just got the tattoos. I lied earlier, didn't get blown off. He texted me, let me see my screen. So I'm going, I'm, I'm hanging out of some sort tonight. But for my tattoos, I got 10022, which is my zip code in New York City. I've lived here for a year, so it's my year anniversary. And then I got a heart on my right pinky. And then I got yellow on the back of my right leg because <laughs> you only live once you know what i mean okay um so yeah now i'm gonna go home and get ready all right i'm back in new york i love being back in new york I, I you know what's fun is landing bright lights is landing in a place where you love it being your home that's what happened so we're back in new york we've got a four-day work week we record on wednesday let's get to it Okay, I've been getting this question how I do my hair like this. Like, do I braid it or do I straighten it? I crimp it. Look, it's like a three barrel roll crimper. It's like so back to high school. Um, but the thing about it is when you crimp your hair, it's the fastest way to do it. So I literally one, two, one, two. And then look, I mean, that's a lot. And I don't do the ends. I just let the ends kind of fall so it looks natural. Okay, we got to talk about this book. I got it in the airport, it's called Clarity Mapping, and I was like, I don't know what it's gonna be about. But it's a journal prompt every day for 30 days, and it asks you, what is your intention? Why am I worthy? Who can I serve? What can I set down? Like, what can I take off my load that I'm carrying that I don't need to be carrying? What's the truest version of myself today? And then it gives you a journal prompt. So tomorrow's is, when have I experienced a failure that led me to something fulfilling and new? So I don't know, but I feel like it's totally MGP approved. Clarity mapping. I don't know who I think I am wearing cargo pants. Episode what? I think it's 33. 33. Yeah. Oh, Yay! Woo! Episode 33. It's time. 33, baby. Coming to a studio near you, Monday.